This is a dynamic type warm-up, great to do before any type of exercise. First one here is alternating quad pull, pulling on the lower leg toward the back of the hips and flexing the abdomen, keeping the knee under the hips. Next is our alternating toe touches. For this one, we're gonna reach down with our right hand and try to touch our left foot and vice versa, left hand to the right foot. And you wanna make sure after each rep, you bring your arm right back to above your head. Great warm up for the hamstrings and hips. Next is alternating figure four, really good one for the glutes and hips. For this one, you wanna grab your lower leg, not your foot, and pull up towards the sky. Next is our alternating archer squat. So we're going down into sort of a single leg squat, swinging the hips open, and the opposite leg is gonna go into a straight position onto the heel. Great warm up for the inner thigh, the adductor muscles. Next is front leg swings. This is really good for the hip flexors and to get the sliding surfaces of the hamstrings warmed up. If you need to hold on to something for balance, that's fine. Try to do it without though, if possible, you get a little bit of balance work if you don't. Next is the alternating adduction abduction leg swings. Great little warm up for the outside and inside of the thigh and the hips. And for this one, you can hold on to something if you need to for balance. You can also do it like I'm showing here without holding on to get a little bit of extra balance work. It's a little bit more challenging to stay balanced on this one than the front leg swings. So if you're limited in your range of motion, you can just hold on to something. Next is our alternating heel paddle. This is a great little warm up for the lower leg muscles, the soleus and gastrocnemius, and also the muscles in the feet, especially if you're not wearing any shoes when you do this one. Just drive the heels down and to the ground, alternating side to side. Next are good old burpees. Excellent full body warm up drill and strengthening exercise. For these, you want to try to be explosive. So, we're going to drop down to the hands, kick those feet back, bring them right back underneath, reach the arms back, and jump high. Create some space between the feet and the ground, and really reach back and be explosive. Next are ankle openers. This is a nice little warm up for the ankles. We're just rolling the toes down towards the ground and bringing them back up as close as you can to your shin, trying to keep your leg as straight as possible. This is a great one to do uh, before any type of exercise, whether you're going for a run or doing squats and lunges. And these are just good old fashioned lunges. I like doing these as a way to warm up the hip flexors better than kneeling on the ground and rocking forward and back. This one's a little bit more dynamic, a little bit more like you would actually use in your actual workout or applies a little bit better to sport like running or playing soccer. And we'll finish up the dynamic warm up with a good old back bridge. So for these, we're just gonna put our hands back behind our head push our hips up off the ground and then when you're ready go ahead and push the shoulders and head up off the ground as well we're not looking to hold it for a really long time here this is just a dynamic warm-up for the spine 